Oh, hi there! Today we're designing a bedroom using only products from IKEA. I'll show you that you can make a space feel well-designed and cozy only by shopping at IKEA and keeping it on the budget as much as you can. I'm on, this is Mars, and today we're taking you through our whole design process and we'll be adding a reveal of the bedroom in the end, so stay tuned. But before we start, please consider subscribing. It really helps our channel so much and it helps you to never miss another video again. Now let's go! We are starting right off by going to the IKEA US website. And from here, the first thing we want to look at is, of course, the most important thing in every bedroom, the bed. So let's look at the full queen and king beds. There are obviously a lot of beds at IKEA, but I always gravitate towards the mall bed. Are there more budget beds than this one? Yes, but if you want to keep it on the budget, I would definitely go with this one or even maybe with this one. It's just a simple bed. This is also a nice bed. It's a bit pricey, but it looks great. I would stay away from beds like this and this. In my opinion, they just feel like boxy and just outdated. This is also a nice bed. I like it, but it's a bit pricey. It's $700, so we're going to pass. Mmm, the mom bed. Just going into this, I knew I was going to pick the mom bed. It's a really nice bed. Is it the, the most budget bed? No, let's be honest, no. There are more budget beds than this one, but if we are going to splurge on anything when designing a bedroom, it should be the bed. I really like the mall bed. It really looks simple, especially in this oak veneer. I just like it a lot. And if you don't like this particular color, you can go with the black one, of course, but I would stay away from uh, the white one and the gray one since they just, they just don't look as good as these two, but I'm definitely going with the mall bed. Maybe we can take this one. Okay, so here it is. Now, do I like this bedding? No. So for the sake of this looking cute from the very beginning, the next thing we're going to choose is the bedding. I think bedding is honestly one of the best ways to make your bedroom look cute. Let's see, duvet covers and duvet cover sets. Ooh, this is a nice one. This is a nice, a nice duvet cover. Duvet cover, how do you say it? I'm sorry for my English. I know you guys have been so amazing when it comes to my English. English is not my native language, so I'll be making a lot of mistakes. So feel free to correct me in the comment section below. I like to learn. Ooh, this is probably one of my favorites. Yes. And it's not that pricey. It's $70. So this is a nice bedding. This is a nice duvet cover set. Let's see if there's something else. This looks also nice. When it comes to bedding, I usually for myself, I pick out something that's just plain, without any pattern. This one is also nice, and this blue one, but I think I'll go with a green. You can find so much duvet cover options at IKEA. Oh, yes. Here's my favorite. My favorite IKEA duvet cover set is this one. I don't know how to pronounce it, but this one's really nice. This one's really nice, but I think just to break, just to break like the, the simplicity, I think we're going to go with this one since it has a cute pattern, just simple, but it's, it's a nice, it's a nice set and it's not as expensive. So we can go with this one. Let me see if I can craft this one to fit. Ooh, yes. Oh, fits like a glove. Oh, wow. I really like it. Just right off the start, this already looks just great. Loving how we started. Now, next thing, we're going to choose side tables. So, end tables and side tables. 
Now, since our bed is obviously like grounded, it's, it doesn't have any legs and my plan is to add floating side tables or something like that. You could absolutely go with something like this. This is just, it just looks nice. Also something like this. It's also a nice uh, looking side table and it comes in a few colors. This one is pretty cute. But when it comes to the bedroom, I always like to keep it closed storage. So let's see. Is there something with closed storage? Mm, this is cute, but I don't really like the shape. Ooh, this one, this one is a new one, I think. Ooh, this looks so good. And it has closed storage. Ooh, nice. It's nice. I don't know if it fits with our bed and bedroom, but this one looks nice. Okay, let's see what else we have. I wanted something floating. Let's check out the Eket cube, cubes and shelves. I was thinking something like this, actually. I think for the side tables, I'm going with this. Yep, this looks nice. Yeah, we're thinking it. Oh, yes, I like it. This looks great. Now, next thing, I was thinking we should add lamps. Lamps are a must when it comes to bedroom, especially the bedside tables. You can add wall lights. However, I think we're going with table lamps. You could definitely go with this one. This is such a cute lamp and it's not pricey at all. It's actually pretty budget friendly. Also the photo lamp, the photo lamp will also look nice. I was thinking something more, uh, I don't know, something like this, but so this is a work lamp. But what if we add work lamps? Oh yes, this, this one, this one. My vision is coming to life. <laughs> Okay, I love the Forza lamp. Okay, this one, we'll put this one here and another one right over here. Wow, this looks so nice. Okay, I love it already. I love where we're going. I hope you like it too. <laughs> I'm really happy with this setup. Nicely done. Now, I want to choose a rug. So let's see. I have a favorite rug, Erikia and that is the Lohals rug. This is my go-to rug when designing any space. Like, this is such a neutral rug, I love it. However, we use the Lohals in our living room IKEA design, so I'll try to think of something else. Oh, this is a nice rug. This is a nice rug and it's not that pricey. Hmm, I like this one. Let's see what else. You could also absolutely a safe option would be the Stockholm rug. It's a nice rug, but it's a bit pricey. I don't want to splurge on the rug. Oh, this, this is a nice rug. This is a nice rug and it's only $79. So, oh yes, 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 yes. I like this one. Let's try it with this one. This is actually not a big rug, but it's a nice rug. It's honestly a nice rug. Oh yes, I think we're off to an amazing start. This, this thing here looks, looks just great. So next thing, I think we're going to need also an overhead lamp. Now, as you know, I don't like the big light. I don't like using the big light. I don't like turning it on. However, it's a must. Think of it as a decor and a practical thing to have. We're adding a big light in our bedroom. So let's see what our options are. Oh, this is the new one. But I, I feel like, I mean, I like this one, but it just feels like it's going to dust over everything when you do that. <laughs> so no, but let's see what we can use for. I, I really like rice paper lanterns in a bedroom. They look nice. This would also be a nice one. And I honestly don't like to match things up. The table lamps were chrome, so I don't like the big light to be also chrome. Let's see what else. Yeah, the, this is also a nice lamp, but also chrome. So we are trying to change things up. We don't want 
everything to be matchy matchy let's see in the shades and bases maybe we can find a shade oh here it is here is our lamp. I had this lampshade in one of my previous videos where I showed you the new IKEA products. This is a new IKEA product and I really like this lampshade and I think it will match perfectly. Let's see. Oh yes. Yes, it's a vibe. It's a vibe. I like it. It really looks nice. It really looks nice. Next, we're looking for a dresser. I honestly would go for the mom dresser, like the mom dresser is my favorite dresser at IKEA, period. But again, I really don't like everything to be matchy-matchy, so I don't like matching the bed with the exact same series, the dresser, so we are going to look for something else. Maybe we'll go with something black. Well, this is a nice dresser. This is a nice dresser and it's a nice price. I like it. I like this one. Let's see how it looks in our bedroom. Yes, it looks nice. It looks nice. We're going with it. It's final. Now, next thing we need for our bedroom would be a full length mirror. Let's look for some full length mirrors. IKEA really has the best budget mirrors. Yeah, this is my go-to. The Havet mirror is a pretty safe option you can go for. We can definitely go with this, but I want to experiment a bit and go for something more fun. Mm, this one has a nice shape, but it's a bit small. This is a nice mirror also, but I don't really like the gold. This is a nice mirror. This is a statement piece, $1.99. This is a bit pricey, but it looks so good. It looks so good. I was thinking of adding art in our bedroom, but instead of going big with the art, we can go big with the mirror and just leave out the art. <laughs> so, ooh, and a gold detail. I love, it's a vibe. So we are going with this one. You can definitely go for something simple, but I personally love this one and it will match our dresser. So mirrors are essential part of any room. I have mirrors all over <laughs> my home. So next, I was thinking of adding some sort of ottoman or a poof or something like that. We could also go for armchair, but that would add up on the cost. So I think we'll keep with the poof. How do you pronounce ottomans? <laughs> Like Ottoman, hmm, fabric, leather. We don't like leather, rattan. Oh, I know. I know which Ottoman I'm going to. The Tolkien Ottoman. This one is such a smart choice. It has so much room for storage. This one would be the perfect addition to our bedroom. Looks good and is practical. It is pricey, but it's not that pricey for a rattan Ottoman. It's handmade. Let's see it in here. Oh, yes. Wow. Okay, one more thing. We need something over the dresser. Usually I would go with art, but IKEA has the worst art. I mean, I'm sorry, I love IKEA, I love shopping there, but IKEA would not be the place to shop for art. So instead of art, I was thinking we can add some sort of shelving unit or just open shelf where you can display decor, maybe some photos, maybe some personal things. So we can add a shelf. So let's see, cube shelves, no. Floating shelves, maybe. Complete wall shelves. Yes, we are looking for something like this. This is a nice shelf. Oh, this one I like. Oh yes. Yes, this one would go perfectly with our dresser. Yes, even the decor, even the decor, I like it. Let's see how it looks. Oh yeah, yes, this really completes the bedroom, in my opinion. Oh, loving it, I love it. Okay, one last thing I like to add, and that is a cushion. This bed is missing something, with the right cushion, we'll just finish everything off. Just one, we're not going overboard with this, we're keeping it on the budget, we're choosing just one cushion. This one I like 
but everything's already green, so we don't want overcrowded with green. Ooh, I love this one. Yes, I love this one. Maybe not, maybe not in red or green. Oh, this one. Yes. Yes. This one is so beautiful, actually. And I wanted to get it my last trip, but they were out of stock. So let's see how this one fits here. Oh, yes. Yes. I think we're done. I'm honestly stunned. We did an amazing job. I think we're ready to see how everything turned out. Are you ready? Let's go. I mean, I love, love, love our bedroom. It really looks so nice. It looks minimal, but has some interest in it. I have no words. I really hope you like it too. It could have been a bit more budget friendly. You could cut something here or there, but I think we did an amazing job. Now I want this bedroom for my bedroom. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think about it into the comment section below. I would really like to know if you like and what would you do differently. Also, you can find links to all of the IKEA products we used into the description box. I really hope you like this video and let me know if you have an idea for another one, let's say for a dining room or we can do a whole apartment. I would love to do that. So let me know if you like this kind of videos and I'll make sure to deliver. Also, please subscribe to the channel and hit the like button since it really helps my channel so much and I will be forever grateful. Thank you again so much for watching and as always, I'll see you designers next week. Bye! Here is Mars, our sleepy boy. He decided to join us. Mars, did you like the bedroom? Oh, well, I'm gonna take that as a yes. Did you manage to sleep well? Oh, he smells like a baby. You're the best dog. You're the best dog. Bye, guys. See you next week. <laughs>